Hey everybody, it's the Musical Gamer again, and welcome back to a special bonus episode of Let's Play Artanelico, The Melody of Alamia. Today we'll be diving into Misha's Cosmosphere Level 4, to be exact, so we could hopefully, well, not only complete that level of the Cosmosphere, but also obtain her freaking him code, which has eluded me thus far. And we need her him code to continue with the game. Uh, no, I am not here to install the crystal quite yet. That will be for the actual plot of the game, not this bonus episode. So here's 500 leaf and just send me into my, um, I, what is Misha to the liner? I'm not entirely sure. I mean, I wouldn't say girlfriend. Um, childhood friendly, yes, let's go with that. And Whoa, why is your world turning into Orica's? Oh wait. Shit, I'm not supposed to talk about other people's Cosmospheres inside someone else's Cosmosphere. Yeah, that's kind of the... Um, I don't really think it's written. It's kind of the unwritten law of uh, Raven Tales and Cosmospheres. You're not really supposed to talk about other Cosmospheres to anybody else. Um, no, Hama, I don't remember you. Kind of like how I don't remember Misha. Even though she was technically my childhood friend. Alright, well, let's take a look at this place first. They have 8 DP. I can afford this. Hey, Crochet, what's up? Glad to see you've recovered from the last level. Hey, um... Why are you so angry? Um, she's not really doing anything. Wait, what? What do you mean you don't know how to plan? Ah, great. Misha's image of people is screwed up yet again. Alright, it's time for Good Samaritan Liner Barset to step in and do something about this. Oh, I swear. Eh, uh, oh! Tell me the hymn code. Oh, okay. Uh, her hymn code is Misha Feu... Aeolia Artanelico. Or Artanelic. Wait, Artanelic? Not Artanelic Co? No, all right, whatever. Um, that third name, Aeolia. Uh, if you remember, that was also the name of one of the goddesses uh, that Orica was talking about. That name will be important later. Actually, I would not even. I would venture to say it's not even important right now in this game, per se. And why is this ADDP? Riddle me this, Batman. Why are you ADDP? Oh yeah, that's a good question. Why do you appear like, uh, a uh, cat girl? Uh, do I want to beat those drums? Well, if I said yes, she would kill me. That's a very good point, Liner. Your sense of fashion is a little off. Don't say that to her face. Just smile and nod, my good friend. Smile and nod. It's the best way to deal with women these days. Alright, moving on to the actual important part. Uh, who said that? Oh, hi, Misha. Um, yeah, that's a good question. Why are you wearing pajamas? Um, wait, what? Yeah, she's... She's a little different than normal. Then again, she's been different from quote-unquote normal every time we've gone into her Cosmosphere. Hey, oh, great, really? Um, alright, let's start here. Misha! Where are you? It... Oh. Okay. 8DP? What is this? Oh, we've ran into Hama again. God, Hama, you're just like everywhere these days. Hmm. That's a good question. Uh, wait, I'm your what? Uh, Liner, I think you just kind of ruined the moment. <laughs> uh, Liner, I, I actually have to be on Hama's side for that. She was about to tell you something pretty important, and you just kind of screwed it up. Uh, you're 70 DP? Why are you 50 DP, then? Yeah, it's kind of cold. Snowball fight? Can I have gloves? Or a machine that propels snowballs at a fast rate? God, I've always, I always wanted to have one of those things when I was a kid, when I used to have snowball fights a lot. 
It's just like those those machines just make everything so convenient. Like they have snowball guns. They have like snowball trebuchets. If you don't know what a trebuchet is, it's those medieval devices that I would fling boulders and sometimes diseased animal diseased dead animals over castle walls back in the Middle Ages. They had those for like snowballs. I mean, it, what transparent? That's cheating, you freaking camper. But uh seriously, like I always wanted one of those like snowball guns when I was a kid. I still would not mind having them having one right now and I'm freaking 19 years old. I mean, god forbid, I would just go on a rampage with the damn thing. I'd probably show up at Baseman or randomize his house and just pelt the shit out of them with snowballs. Oh god. Who would want to see a video of me doing that? Please, somebody somebody say yes cuz I really want to do that now. Oh, um, okay. Sure, Misha, well, whatever you say. I guess we won't be going into that forest anytime soon. Uh, oh, God, and wait a minute, it's this person. Didn't we see you in Orca's Cosmosphere? Mom? Uh, Misha, I hate to break it to you, but the only thing you two have similar is the fact you both, I think, have green eyes. I know Misha has green eyes. Does, does her mother have green eyes? She might have blue eyes. I don't know, I can't tell from this distance. The, the quality of my TV is really crappy uh, with standard composite cables, even with the PS2. It's kind of depressing, actually. I mean, I'm using S-Video to record the actual video, but I have composite uh, quality looking at the TV. <sighs> Whatever. Uh, oh, the forest. The forest we just got chased away from? Yeah, the... Huh. Alright, I guess we're heading back to the forest then. For 190 DP and some art. Sounds like a fair trade. No. Yeah, oh, we had voice acting. I didn't even know. What was that voice? It came from over there. Misha, don't be so selfish. No, I don't want to. I don't want to ever grow up. Said Peter Pan. Misha? Liner. Don't come any closer. Oh, Liner, will you please talk some sense into her? She says she doesn't want to grow up. So what, you want me to smack her around a little bit? I can do that. Please calm down, ma'am. She'll have to grow up eventually. She's just not ready yet. Don't you know anything? She's already grown up. She's just masquerading as a child so she can act foolish. It, wait, what? What? Come over here and take a closer look. No, stay back! If I remember correctly, there, you were old. Or older in level two. It, whoa. What? Misha, you're all grown up. Um. Yes, this is how she's supposed to look. Why are you tied up and covered in thorns? No, this isn't the real me. The real you? Then what is the real you? This body. Don't make me break it. Uh, let's not do anything hasty now. <gasps> okay, she's doing something hasty. That's yeah! that works too. I I suppose. Stop that. You can't break your body with that. Then I'll craft a song strong enough to destroy this body in one blast. Oh crap, that's not an idle threat. She actually could do that. Misha. Uh, Liner, you better chase her. I'm sorry to drag you into this. What happened to her? Why is she acting like that? She discarded her grown body so she could remain a child. But but why? She always dreaded growing up and losing her freedom. Okay, I guess. She has an important destiny to fulfill. Right, singing Chronicle Key. She stopped whining recently and began acting like an adult. Then not so long ago, she decided she had enough of being a grown-up and discarded her normal grown-up body. No one knows why she did it. Perhaps she has a new problem? Could it be... That I'm the reason? Oh yeah, you did say something very insensitive to her. I think in herself. level two. If she succeeds, she may even disappear. Oh, that's not good. What? She looked very determined. She is capable of crafting a song powerful enough. Like I said, that's not an idle threat. She will you do have it. To stop her before she gets that far, please. Sure thing, um, mother. Well, Misha crafted the sonic shot green magic. 
what which isn't really that useful, honestly. What is it now? You may not have caused this mess in the first place, but now you're responsible for it. Oh, great logic there, Hama. God. Yeah, yeah, I know. Now I gotta go find her. I hate responsibility. Fuck responsibility. All right, moving on. ADDP, sure, no problem. We've got 2,100. Oh, no voice acting anymore. Uh, oh, God, no, please, don't do this. Wait, no, come on. Why am I stopping you? Because you're being stupid? Lan, I can't let you die, that, that too. Why would I hate you? You're gonna make me move, aren't you? It, what the hell? I'm guessing that's her new song. Ow. You bitch. Oh, crap. I hope we weren't out long. Wait, th that doesn't make sense. I mean, first of all, I am not a pedo, so I will not be seeing you with a 12-year-old body. I mean, how old is Liner? I think Liner's 19, technically. Yeah, Liner should be 19 years old. Misha, uh, is technically 18. And Orica, I believe, is 17, is the ages for those three. And Liner is being a badass, of course, of course. Oh, good. Thank God. DP makes the world go round. It managed to convince her not to kill herself. That's... That is quite comforting. Sort of. Uh, Stonehenge? Well, what are we doing? It's not time for the paradigm shift. So what is it that you want to destroy? The fake me. Uh, wait, say what again? The fake Misha? Yes. Just like my mom said, the small Misha, it's not real. The real Misha is all grown up. In the real world, I'm really 18. So of course I don't really look like this. Well, at least I was right about her age. So I'm going to destroy this body and the whole fake world that I created. Misha, wait. I don't know if that's such a good idea. I'm gonna do it. Uh oh, crap. Oh, here we go again. Oh, sweet Jesus. Whoa, it's shaking really hard. This oh, whoops. Didn't mean to do that. It paradigm shift. Is that the paradigm shift? Well, I wouldn't hate you because you just got a pair of boobs. Why would I do that? I would love you even more. Ugh, that's kind of beside the point. Well, anyway, with that, we have completed Misha's Level 4 Cosmosphere. On a very grim note, I might add. We also got her hymn code, thank Christ, and her costume, Sheep Sweets. I'm going to have to change her costume, I just realized. Yes, I'm back in one piece. Oh, and now we can install in Misha. Excellent. Excellent, excellent, excellent. You know, this actually might be why we can't download the hymn crystal, I just realized. That actually does have some continuity to it then, I guess. Because once you complete level 4, that's when you can, uh, download the crystal. Actually, wait, no. Technically, we would have been able to download it just by being in level 4, because she gave it to us. Hama gave us the code before we finished the level and then we might not have completed the level and it oh whatever either way i'm going to burn you horai because you piss me off to no end and i have the hymn code um yeah so i guess in the next episode the extra the actual plot episode 
We'll finally be downloading that hymn crystal to, um, whichever Raven Tail I choose. This will not be a vote. I'm actually choosing who it is. Uh, for reasons which I'll explain in the next episode, next time on Let's Play Artanelico. This is the Musical Gamer, signing off. See you guys next video.